Oh, I didn't even know I was recording. Look at the braids on already flew to the front. That's embarrassing. Okay. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Ray. And I can tell from my voice, I'm feeling a little bit on the not so great side <laughs> i just been in the house chilling i don't know how in the world i got this little cold going on but i am about to do a braid out on my hair look at that nappy mess we love that i just washed it well i didn't wash it i just put deep conditioner in it that's all i did because i just got a blowout um last weekend and it wasn't really dirty but it got nappy so i want to try these products by the do these are more so wash and go products but i'm going to use them for a braid out i'm gonna use this mousse and this big papa gel about to do i got these both from target so we're gonna see how it turned out i'm about to braid it just your regular traditional braid out and we're gonna see how it goes i can never get my braids my twist anything very tight at the roots i don't know why i don't know if it's the way i braid i don't know if it's my grip but i can never get it tight at the root but we're gonna see how it comes out and everything and yeah all right and i just finished this is how the braids are looking Nice and juicy, like I said, not that tight at the root. I don't know how to get them really tight at the root. Look how different these lengths look. Weird. But it's looking so juicy. Like, I cannot wait to see how this turns out. Like, give it up for the ends. Like, come through the do. We are here for these ends. We love freshly trimmed ends, like. Love that. Ready to see how this turn out? I'm gonna leave me in for probably like two, three days. Probably to the weekend. Today's Tuesday. Like, I don't know. Like I said, not feeling the best. So, we'll see. But this is where we at. I don't know what day I did these braids, but it's Saturday. I know they've been in for a good little minute. Probably since Monday, to be honest. But we are about to take them out. And like I said at the beginning of the video, I use this mousse and this gel for this braid out. I just do some leave in. I can do more detail if y'all want, but I just didn't think putting my hair in braids was an interest. So I just want y'all to see how it come out on my kind of hair, type four. But I can go through and show y'all how I braid it and everything. I got like short hair, type four, as you can see. And these braids have been in for a good little minute. I'm gonna go in with me L's Viral Growth Oil. And just put that in my hair before I take the braids out. I really hope this stuff works because my hair has been short all my life. I have been natural since 2017 and it's 2023. Yeah, and I take them too. It's going to be six years in December. So it's a fresh five years. I don't know. I thought I was going to be like freaking EC Meme. I hope that's how you say her name. I've been following her since I went natural. That's my girl. That's how I thought my hair was going to be in five years, baby. Like easy my mm -hmm. We're just gonna rub that in. Try not to make it too frizzy. Just go in and do a scalp massage. And we are going to try to take these braids down as good and smooth and easy as possible. It's so hard for me to take down my braids with my nails. It's like it just adds on a layer of frizz unnecessarily. Look at the braids don't already flew to the front. That's embarrassing. So here we go. Pull it, just pull it where it naturally separates. And then I just pull it until it comes up. This is the definition we are getting. Okay, do. I don't want to try to do since Trey tried it, like when it first, first came out. But I, didn't, I never like went to Target to actually look for the products. It's like I had my products that I knew worked and I didn't want to try anything else. This is the definition we are getting. Okay. And I'm gonna just go ahead and separate now because I don't like having to go back in and separate. I like to just go ahead and get all my separation. I only separate probably like two of the three strands. And that's what we are getting. This is so cute. Let me take out another one for y'all. This one is a little bit smaller, so we're going to have a little bit more trouble. Trouble, 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 baby. Yeah, this is going to take forever because I'm going to get impatient and probably going to frizz the mess out of this. But I'm getting my nails cut short while my hair is natural. 
because this just does not work like it just adds a layer of frizz unnecessarily but you see how that piece is already frizzy let's go to the nails leave a little like gel residue i'm seeing it some little white flake i'm loving the hole that it's giving already i never done a braid out with gel before or even a gel like product i always just do it with some kind of twisting something okay it's a little bit frizzy but look at these pieces all right so this is the hair I took down first of all it's a lot of frizz in the front i don't know if that's all due to my nails i don't know if that's all due to me taking it down like leaving it up for a while but we do got some good definition in here we got movements it's hard for me to get definition and movement in my type hair but yeah i mean the frizz uh, not my favorite but i would definitely do this again for love and style Let's see what's back I definitely need to do some to these front pieces because they are just aggravating the mess out of me. All right, I just pushed it back in the front. This is my little go-to style. And I am really feeling this. Like, my hair looks so much healthier since I got it cut and everything. But, yeah, hopefully it looks cute in the back. Can't really see it. I'm going to look at it after I watch this video. And it's a little crazy. I'm going to go back in and separate it. But I love these products from the Do. I give it an 8 out of 10, but I'm loving this. Okay, do. Okay, do. <laughs> but yeah, we are here for this. We are here.